This is the new framing we did um, for the patio area. The inspector wants you to check all the framing we did. So this is extra tall and it's like 10, 10 foot ceiling, right? Yeah, same, ten, same, same ceiling. 10 feet ceiling. Yeah. So this area here is, uh, is the new build wall that we did for the patio because used to be a patio it just completely and, and then you know there's a stepping down but we put the deck wood down here the plywood down so it's ready level, level. and uh, and this is just the bedroom from here okay so this is just the new bedroom and then this is the beam uh, connection. How big is the beam? How thick? Uh, what's the beam? Four by fourteen. Four by fourteen. Mm -hmm. And uh, how long is mm, this I'm beam? Sorry, four by twelve. Four by twelve. And then uh, what's how long? Uh, Sixteen foot. Sixteen foot. Sixteen foot. Just from the point of the starting of this area here, and uh, and it goes in all the way crossing the patio area because it used to be this is the wall this area is the wall of the original and uh, exterior wall to access to this is the, the door to uh, to enter the house so now we close off this patio we make uh, additional bedroom So all those, uh, you know, the, the wood, plywood boarded area used to be on the patio area. We made a closet and then additional added into the bedroom. So it's a very large bedroom, 16 feet almost, 15 feet long bedroom. So this is the two by four wall. And now we're gonna go to the hallway, this is the existing hallway and just with the the new wall uh, coming and the inside is the closet for the other side of the bedroom and then we reframe the mm. the window here just this is the additional this is the hallway and that goes into the bathroom here so this is the bathroom do we need to show the bathroom because uh, that's additional the extra that we did right the bathroom in here The HVAC is not put it in yet, but we will need that the permit. And then this is the, the, the living room. And then this is the other bathroom, bedroom from this side. That's the existing bedroom, but just made it a little bit smaller. This is the orange one because we built a wall against here. And then this is the, the closet area. So that's the front two bedroom with the living room and then the hallway and toilet and then coming over here uh, we widen the, the the doorway so this is the kitchen area uh, Leo do we have enough uh, support in this area here we don't need, we don't need? okay so this is the this is the kitchen. And we have a very big window which we put a very big beam on top of it. So what's this beam size? 4 by 12. 4 by 12. Okay. And then crosses the whole crossing the whole window here and with a post on both sides. And then this is just a, just a reframe of a new window here. And uh, over here, we close off the door. And so it's just a reframe of a new window here. And we add a walk-in closet 
for the, the other side of the bedroom. So this is the, like the dining room area from the kitchen, I guess to the dining room area. And that goes to, that's the, like the front door of the house. And then here is the little hallway. And then we have the bathroom here. Uh, sink, toilet, and the shower. And then this is the bedroom. And then this is the other side of the bedroom. And this is the closet, space-wise. Closet and bedroom. So we have the, um, we already get rid of the, the platform here. And that's where um, the, the condenser is gonna go. Cause this is the, the house coming in. And uh, this is the front part of the house. And then this is the, the, the front door. <laughs> and uh, and then this one here is where the condenser is gonna sit. Yeah, some some potting some point here, and then this is just a, a little surrounding, so somebody be able to walk around uh, the whole area around the the building. And that's the garage with a concrete pad coming through. So overall, this is uh, understanding the condenser is right here, the dining room, kitchen, living uh, family room or living room, and then the, the bedrooms. And at the very back of the opposite, between the kitchen, the living room, uh, the, 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 the kitchen and the, the living room, in the right in the middle, we will have the tankless water heater.